Now, so Jeremy comes out and um, within seconds I had him admitting he was a spy sent out by the FBI. He worked for Obama. He uh, was a male in the mail room mm. that sorted Obama's mail. And um, <clears throat> foolishly boasting how he was hired often by the FBI to go undercover. And his password to his computer was agent, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Put two and two together there. <laughs> so uh, I, I played him like a, uh, a mullet on the end of the line. Because the more Ashra did the talking, the more frustrated he got. Mm. He wanted me to do the talking. And I said, no, she can do it better than I can. And his task was to get me to talk. Right? <laughs> so it was, it was quite an experience. Now Dex comes out. Does he behave like he was an MI5 agent when he said to me he was when he first got here? <laughs> <laughs> I said, it's pretty obvious. Mm. <clears throat> when he's going back to uh, England, he hits the airport and they immediately stamp him legal and it allows him to fly out. <laughs> no questions asked. Mm. So uh, Dex was a very, very um, clever futures trader. I mean, it's, it's obvious if you're in the futures and he decides to give it up and that's his story, then uh, he's coming out. He's almost blackmailing the MI6 to stop him. Mm. He was coming out to prove it. So I think we did. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so uh, he came out the uh, moment my brother died. So uh, that's drawing a pretty thin line. Mm. Because I always thought I could get my brother to tell the truth. Just one. Never worked out, unless he did something he did, but no, I didn't hear about it. <coughs> But Dick shows up. Is that some moment? <clears throat> and the, uh, the miracles just start pouring out from that to the point where he was uh, seasick for three days. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> so is that mass delusion or, or. And he came up with it. I didn't say nothing, right? Mm. He fulfilled the prophecy. So suddenly he saw himself being an MI6 agent in a position of uh, himself being the actual reason he is the agent to get him here to become acquainted with God. And what the MI6 and death threats meant were nothing. He's just gonna tell the truth, which he did on the radio, talking to, uh, what's it, uh, Donnie? Donnie, yeah. So Donnie gets shut down as soon as he admits that he had a dream where it said I was right. Yeah, that's right. Next time he, next, he shut down, right? Mm. Then the trolls go in and they start copying his, his website as if it's him. Mm. <laughs> so it's pretty bloody obvious, isn't it? Yeah, that's a bit of a giveaway. <laughs>